We got bananas in chat from Ollie95XZ and I Louvre Cats. And also Stellion and Verizon Amiga and Ben R31415, Sir Classington, Alessanders, your everyday J Twitch. Uh S Dicks Hungry. I butchered that one. In room Rod Knight UK. Thank you for the bananas, peeps. Any player 14, appreciate it. And uh, your everyday J Twitch again with more bananas. Bring me a double dose of bananas to let me know that we're live. Appreciate it, everyone. Thank you for all of those bananas. Feels like we have a lot less subs in than usual today. There's Camo J, AMAM, JG424. See, these are the names I'm used to reading. Bill Cooper Hicks, Bill Man, 68, Cluster Fluff. Uh, it kind of feels like all of a sudden now there's a swarm of bananas. So maybe it took a while for everyone else to catch up and uh, get the, the stream as well. Appreciate the bananas, everyone. Thank you so much. What did you guys think of uh, the pre-stream song? It was the Cockatoo Twins with Pandora. And I saw one comment. Someone sounds said, it sounds like she's saying Applebee. And it does sound like that. Uh, but what's really cool about her singing is that she doesn't, she doesn't use any uh, any language although some some you know words will sound well they're not words that's the point she just uses her voice like for noise it's clever uh, Sir Classington says very cool very nice song I love cats says it was pretty cool and AMA says beautiful it was a beautiful song wasn't it seems like a lot of you liked it that's great yeah they're a great band if you like that song check out the record of theirs called treasure that's what it was from and uh, it's probably my favourite, but to, in all fairness, I've never listened to too much more beyond that one record of theirs. They're probably a band I should give uh, a bit more time to. Right, let's craft up some more seeds, because we should, in theory, yep, now have enough. There we go. So we're making some more Tier 5 seeds and getting in some more of this mystical agriculture stuff. Cluster Fluff says, who are they again? Uh, the Cockatoo Twins. They're from Scotland. Campfire says, what's the plan for today, X? Also, what tea are you drinking? I've got on a Sam tea, and today I will need plenty of tea reminders because I feel like enjoying this thing while it's hot. So feel free to remind me in about 10 minutes from now. Um, I want to finish this book, you know. Like, I want to get through and, and do all the stuff in this book. So let's check out the price of the Supremium stuff. Oh, there's a red one as well, isn't there? That might be quite cheap, I think. Or maybe not. I don't know. We need some apples. Do we even have any apples to begin with? No. But we have an Infernium apple. I think uh, I think we should build a new platform just over there and farm trees on it. And uh, Surging Tide says, Oh my god, X, I finally caught you. Can you check the your bubbles inventory and see if something disappeared? This is my bubbles inventory. I've got a Null Charm. I don't know what that does. By uh, B-Way... BYK70R says, Hi X, what are your thoughts on Nintendo Switch? You probably don't care, but I just uh, want to know what you think. Yeah, uh, you're right, I don't really care. I've seen it advertised, it doesn't appeal to me. I'm just, just not interested in it. Like, what, what more could I say, man? What more could I say? Should we look for a block that isn't so boring as stone? I was thinking to myself, I was thinking to myself, Chisel was in this pack. Shizzle! Shizzle! We need to make a mod called Shizzle! It could have Snoop Dogg in it. <laughs> uh, oh, really? Are you kidding? No, 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 no. Hang on, hang on. Aha! Right, so we have all of these blocks. And it just kind of occurred to me the other day that some of these blocks are obviously very nice. Hmm. We want to make a clay farm, I think. That's, that's a little project we'll do today as well. That's what I'm looking for, this stuff, right? Factory block, the recipe being that one. Aha! Yes, we can make factory blocks. I completely forgot about this. If I'd have known that a while ago, we might have built some pretty looking things with this. Anyway, this, this world is forever going to be... It's Honestly, it's forever going to be a, uh, a derpy... A derpy platform world. We're just here to learn about mods and hang out and have a good time, you know? Your everyday J Twitch says, X, this is... Is this world different from the one we see on YouTube? Yes, it is. It is actually a different world. Can you believe it? What is this ugly looking thing? Grinder. I mean, I've seen all these textures before, but I forget about them. I mean, that's just... Ugh. Stop offending my eyes. <laughs> 
I really love the eye chisel. You can preview what they look like together. The assassin says, this is a stream world. Yes, it is. It is a world of the stream. Oh, I... Again, in my head, I thought we were going to see a preview. I used this one here on... Uh, on Hermit Pack recently, and I really liked it. I thought, oh, actually, that's a very nice texture. So, how about we go with this one? We're going to just make another, what is that, like, 9x9 nine nine platform again? So, one, oops, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and then one more to go around that. Pretty cool. Cool beans, and then we'll build something in the middle. Uh, Pogolo says, I can't hear anything. Go to the doctor, get a hearing test. Why can't you hear anything, man? What's going on? Halo 2 Freak says, X, I've always watched your live stream on the second channel. I'm glad I caught you live. Welcome to the uh, stream, buddy. Thanks for checking them out on the second channel. They're there for your convenience. And uh, nice to have you live with us today. That's what I'm saying. All right, let's make some more of this stuff. Bam. And uh, we'll just put that right there. There we go. What are we building on this thing again? I've already forgotten what we were going to do. We were going to chop down some trees. I reckon what we should do is try a farming station with a lumber axe. Fertilized essence. Bone, mer bone mill that works on resource crops. Does this have a recipe? No. I'm just going to frighten the storage system for now. Alessanders says you made it 10. Oh no. Let's quickly go back and count. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It's nine. I knew it. I knew I did it right. Malevent there with a banana. Thank you for the banana. Just letting us know that they're late. It is quite all right, my friend. So let's go grab a, t a torch. We haven't even got a basic torch now. Well, that is not good. Hi, I double clicked. Okay, torches. Apparently we already had some in our inventory. That's brilliant. Let's double click here so the inventory isn't ugly. And we're going to put away all the stuff in Big Reactors. I, I'm going to, now that I know the basics, I'm going to try watching a Big Reactor video again. And then maybe I've got a better point of reference. You know, because I understand a few of the things. And I'm hoping we can make one of those super duper ones at some point. You know, like one that produces a million RF. <laughs> X, the gig is today, says Aloba Sykes. Which gig are we talking about? You've alarmed me now, because I'm thinking, hang on, what's going on here? What's on my calendar? Uh, we want a farming station. Sweet. I believe we went through a bit of hassle to make some of this stuff before. So, those things are easy. If you've got pulsating iron nuggets, they are. Hi. We would like a few more of those. Thank you very much. Right. And then we've got that little face to make. We've got a little zombie face to make, and then we're good. Zed logic. What do we need? Stuff. Okay, look, we, we can do stuff. Uh, wait, this is not a live of the solo episode, says Shan B. No, it's not. It is nothing to do with the Rendog world. Y you'd be amazed. Like, every single stream, I still get asked this. It's crazy. Let's uh, go put some things here. Then we'll grab some redstone. Then we need a zombie skull, which is something we might not actually have. Uh-oh. Oh, we just happen to have an insane amount of zombie skulls. Well... We've got a noise in my ear, that's for sure. In fact, have I read out any noises in my ear this stream? I think I might have neglected them. Look at that, we've actually collected a few skulls. Sweet, I think that was from those that mob farm that we had that got blown up. <laughs> uh, after today's right, today's episode on, on the YouTube channel, you've got to go watch because it's going to be amazing, right? Um, after, after that, the next time we stream in this one... We're going to build an insane mob farm. We're going to build an insane mob farm. Halo Freak says, X, uh, super serious question. Do you peel your bananas from the top or the bottom? My boss opens them from the bottom, and I think that's just wrong. If the top is the bit where the stem connects you know, all the bananas together, I've always done it like that. I've never thought about doing it the other way, but I think it doesn't matter, really. It doesn't matter, really. I mean, the, the real pro answer there would have been to have said, I eat the whole thing, but I've missed that opportunity to troll. Uh, however, I pass I pass this golden trolling on to all of you. Uh, right, where is the machine that we use to make... What was it called? A slice? Slice and splice? Oh, I know where it is. It's over here. Hello, machine. We need to use you. Help us make a thing. There we go. Thank you very much. Right. Um, Lord Carnage asking the same question in a way, which end do you open your bananas? Crazy. 
Hey, Aim says insane in the main membrane. Gone insane like Kurt Cobain. Although, I don't think he went insane. I mean, jeez, let's not talk about that, though. Right, farming station. We got that. We want to put it over there with a flux point and a bunch of cable stuff, which we will grab right now. We've got a donation here, noise in the ear, from Sir Classington saying, Hi, X, here is some tea funds. Glad you're streaming today. Just been told that I got to the hospital for an enoscopy. <laughs> or enoscopy? So I have to... So I have to have two weeks off uni. Uh, love your Sky Factory streams as I'm trying to learn it myself. Uh, that sounds like it could almost be a good thing if you wanted two weeks. No, I imagine it's a bad thing. You know, being in the hospital is never good. Uh, but but make make the most of that time laying in laying in a bed or, or whatever situation you're in. You know, unwind a little bit. Because I imagine uni can be uh, difficult. And appreciate the donation, man. Thank you for the contribution to the tea fund. And this will serve as a tea reminder. I'm telling you now, this tea is too hot for X, but he's going to try and sip it anyway. Mm. JG says, how do you open the banana when you can't pull it apart from the stem? You just use your hands, man, and rip it in half. And Loba Sykes says, I'm going to a concert of Metalcore. It is my first concert ever, and I'm afraid I might get hurt on the pit. Uh, I just want to jump and scream and ah. Dude, when it comes to moshing, you can get hurt in mosh pits. Now, now I'm a mosher. I've, I've moshed in many pits. And I absolutely love moshing. I think it's great. But there are a few things you should know. You can get hurt. I've seen people break their legs in mosh pit. Like, and it, it happens. Like, if you decide you want to go in it, if you're looking at it and thinking I can, I would say... Stay on your feet the best you can. Keep your arms close to your chest. And uh, don't let your arms get caught between other people. Uh, that, that would be my advice. But I, I'm not going to encourage anyone, you know, to do it. And remember, you can always you can always like stand at the back and jump up and down and shout, shout if you want as well. <laughs> um, it's all up to you. Anyway, we've got no more noises in the ear. We'll get to those in a second. I need to... and I think I need an import and an export at this point. So we probably want a conduit. Hi, I'm not searching in the right place. We want a conduit. Then we want that um, that thing. Network something. No. Oh, what was that block called? I had it in my inventory and I put it back in here. And now I've forgotten. Jeez, I can't remember. Oh, it's literally there. Interface. Yes, there we go. Right, we got it. We want an interface, an item conduit. And then we want our cables. And that's all the things we need. And a flux flux point. Um, so we've got a donation here. Noise in the ear from I Love Cats, or I Louvre Cats even. Correction there, I Louvre Cats. Says, uh, hey X, hope you're having a wonderful morning. And you can just plant a sapling near the farming station you already have. Did you AFK on this world yet? Oh, and are you going to update the mods? I stay on the same version as you so I could help. Uh, I'm not going to update the mods because of the old if it ain't broke rule, you know. It might be a good idea to update and I might actually change my mind. But as of right now, um, we're going to stay on this world or this update even. Okay, more seeds. More power to you. I could just put trees over here as well, but we're essentially going to just put nothing but um, essence stuff on this one. This one here will probably be converted to another one of those as well. And then this one will be for trees, I reckon. And uh, Avian Flame says, I had a friend in high school break her collarbone in a mosh pit. It, it can totally happen, man. It can totally happen. I mean, like, I'm, a, I'm a big person who stays on their feet. Like, I've got a good sense of balance. And the worst that I ever got was a cracked rib. And and that was it. But, I, you know, like, you can well and truly get hurt. And I think you have to be careful to realize that some mosh pits are a lot friendlier. And some mosh pits are more violent. And, you know, like, I've, I've, I've seen some really bad pits as well. Like, I've seen some where people are throwing fists, which ain't on, really. Um, so you have, to be, you have to be really cautious, you know. And, uh, and you can get hurt. That's just, that's just the advice I want to pass on, you know. Don't, don't, don't run in there and think you're going to be uh, Superman or something. Right, let's... Wait, what did I come over here? I need some dirt now, right? And we made all of this super fertilized dirt or whatever it's called. We have to look at it this side. Fertilized dirt from hatchery. That's the one that we want. 
Uh, Bentley UK says mosh pits at a boy zone concert are worse than most. I don't think boy zone has ever seen a mosh pit. Jeez. Uh, Jensen says mosh pits are mainly American. And that's kind of not true. They're kind of international. Like I, every gig I go to in the UK will have mosh pits. You know. Uh, for everyone asking, a mosh pit is the part of a crowd at like a rock or metal concert where people push and shove into each other. And that might sound strange, but it is it is uh, pretty awesome, like a good mosh pit. Um, what? I keep coming back over here, man. Fertilized dirt. Do we have that? We do. That's amazing. I would like to make some more. Can we make that? The fertilized dirt requires chicken manure, which I have been voiding. We're going to have to stock up on chicken manure again, peeps. I know it's going to make this place smelly, but it's got to be done. I think it's one of these. Hi. We want the chicken poop. Thanks. So, uh, I love cats. Thank you for the donation. Appreciate that. we got a new subscriber. It's Bentley UK. Thank you for subscribing. Appreciate your support. And uh, Campfire says, Moshing doesn't make sense to me. Is that how metal is physically expressed? It's how it's physically expressed for some people. Um, it probably doesn't make sense for you because it looks painful, right? Like it looks like you you'll get hurt, but that's sort of in a strange way, sort of the point. Like it's not a lot of pain; it's physical, but it's a place to like let out your anger and aggression. And you might think that means that. You know, it's a confrontational environment. It's not at all. It's like everyone is there for the same reason. And, uh, and you know, like when people... Like there's etiquette in a mosh pit. If someone falls down, you pick them up. If someone gets hurt, you help them out of there and get them to safety. Uh, unfortunately, not always everyone thinks along these lines. You get some prats who go in there thinking they're going to punch someone and ha ha ha, whatever. Uh, but the general etiquette is that you look out for other people when you're in there. Uh, I prefer a rave. It's like non-contact moshing, says Jimmy. Yeah, 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 it's another way of looking at it, isn't it? Let's uh, let's put this farming station in place. Bam, we're going to put our PowerPoint on top of it, I reckon. Then, oh, doesn't this thing... Actually, this thing doesn't need water, I've just remembered. So, we'll put the uh, PowerPoint right there. We will say... Which network is it? Mystical farming? Eh, we'll, we'll give it its own network at some point, I'll say. <laughs> Aloba Sykes says, have you seen the new Infant Annihilator video clip? Man, they aren't human, it's so creepy. I have actually just recently heard of that band that have a a ridiculous band name. <laughs> uh, I didn't and it wasn't particularly interested. Like Deathcore music, like I was I was like watching that scene. Like I was going to all the gigs, seeing all the fresh bands of Deathcore. And at the time, at the time it was great fun, but it, it well and truly felt like a fad. It's really surprising that Deathcore is still really popular to me. And I listen to some of the new Deathcore bands, and it, t to my ears it just doesn't feel like they're doing anything other than uh, doing the same old thing, so to speak. So, like, I can listen to that music, it's alright, but bands like that just don't really interest me so much anymore. Um, right, no seeds. This thing needs configuring, doesn't it? We probably need a lumber axe in here, an unbreakable one. Let's go. Uh, let's go put some saplings down or something. Let's see if we can get this tree farming going, man. That's what I'm interested in doing. Uh, sapling. I just realised something else. It's going to try and plant it in every space if I give it a lot of these, and it will pick up a lot of these. So you have to use the quadrants for four different tree types, right? So maybe we don't need a lot of fertilised dirt. Let's uh, let's try and grow some. Oh, we ain't got enough jungle saplings. Let's let's get some mineral growing as well. Let's see how this works. You know. Refax says, "Hey, X, do you like black metal? Even if you don't, check out Summoning. It's hella melodic and surfic. Um, summoning, Summoning are one of my favourites, man. Uh, I absolutely love black metal. That's my, one of my favourite forms of music. Uh, I love Summoning's records." Oathbound, which I think they released in 2006, and also, is it Stronghold? Stronghold is the first, I heard I heard that when I was like a kid, <laughs> and I absolutely fell in love with that record, and uh, I had a bootleg of it, I had a bootleg of it, and and then I found it like not so long ago, like maybe like half a year ago, I like pulled it out again and started listening to it, it's got the song Farewell on it I think, 
really, really cool band. I love Katz's Summoning What. It's the name of a band. They they take a lot of inspiration from Lord of the Rings and write really epic music with like awesome. Uh, yeah, just uh, they're just a cool band, man. That's that's what it needs to be said. Um, right, so this quadrant that I've just marked out, we're going to put some stone in it as well. Um, so anyway, let's catch up with our messages because I've got noises in my ear. Jeez, my ear is full of noises. Hi, I'd like some of that, please. Thank you. Um, so Rev Dragonus is here with a donation, saying I tweeted you a video on how to build a max size reactor to produce 1.8 million RF per tick. Prepare you for that quest in your book. Hope it helps. I saw your video. I didn't. I didn't watch it. I just saw the video and thought I will check that out later today. Uh, appreciate you sending me that. Yep, I need to do the research now to figure out how to build bigger reactors, don't I? Uh, Toxic Melon says, X, do you like Avenged Sevenfold? I do. Uh, I really like their latest records, The Stage. I never really listened to anything of theirs since their very first record. Um, the one with, is it Darkness Surrounding on it? Right, so anyway, let's focus. This is, what quadrant is this? I believe it is Southwest. So southwest is that one. If we give it those and lock it, it should plant them there. But does it need something to plant them? No, it's planted them. Okay, so there you go. That's how it works. So if we want to grow other trees, we need to keep in mind that it's going to put the saplings down on every piece of dirt. Okay, that doesn't look like a regular hoe anymore. <laughs> uh, but an axe is what we need to find it. So we need to make one. Arangelo says, do we have any plans for today? We're making a tree farm so that we can get apples to make a Supremium apple and tick it off in our book. Stronghold is the second, I think, after Lugbergs, as far as I know. Anyway, really awesome you know them, and I feel like they're much underrated, says Refax. Um, yeah, you're right, I think Stronghold is their second record. They're, they're sort of underrated, but within in the community that knows about them, I think they're well and truly appreciated. Uh, Toxic Melon says, Sounding of the Seventh Trumpet, that's the name of the record, yep. That one is the, the one that I listened to uh, a lot back in the day when it came out. X, is there a band you don't like? Entirely hate, never heard you answer no uh, to a do you like and so question. I don't really like to hate on music. Like, I just feel like that's a waste of time. Like, because let's say I hate band XYZ. You know, I'm basically, I'm, I'm basically creating like some sort of standard or idea of what music should be and then holding them up to it where it's, they've got their own you know lives world and they're making their own music um, and basically I think hating on music is just a load of rubbish um, so even even something really poppy and like corporate at the end of the day like it's just sounds you know it's a waste of your time to hate on it that being said there are bands that do you know you can't help yourself sometimes things just you turn your nose up at it. And one, ba one band came to mind when you said that, but I can't think of it right now. I can almost think of it. It'll come to me later on and I'll tell you. Um, what are we over here for again? We're going to make a lumber axe, I think. Ah, we can't look at it that way. We're going to have to go down to our tinker's table. XYZ are overrated, says Jimmy. Oi! <laughs> There's probably a band called XYZ. And so you can go and you can go and rant and rave about them, and then people will say they're overrated. You can make that happen, man. Don't let your dreams be dreams. Right, let's have a look for it's this thing. Oh, oh, we moved the tool forge. It's up here. Jeez, I can't remember. Um, we got so Rev. Thank you for the donation. We got a new subscriber. It's Shamb One S. Thank you. I'm gonna call you Shambis for subscribing. Appreciate it. We need to put down torches over here. That is a thing that we really need to do. You know? Do you know? Uh, X, sorry, Game Wizard says, X, I don't, I don't want to get to the end of Hermitcraft Season 4. So here's the question. When is Season 5 going to start? A week today, man. A week today. Jeez. Uh, let's throw this down over here. And uh, we have a resubscribe for six months in a row from... Miyataki saying, has it really been six months? Thank you for your quality content, X. And thank you for subscribing, my friend. And wow, that thing just grew. Uh, appreciate it. It's been half a year already. Crazy stuff. And Surging Tide says, can you see the question mark goes away when you take off the null charm, please? Okay. Gotcha. 
Question mark be there. Nope, question mark is still there. It's got nothing to do with the Null Charm, man. I don't even know what that Null Charm does, you know. I ain't got no clues. Rusty Tool says X, you have a lot of music on vinyl. I don't actually. Most of my music's on CDs. Um, my vinyl collection, I was going to start a vinyl collection because I love album art and there's some records I think would be really awesome to have on vinyl. But then I realised that's going to be an investment of a lot of money in order for me to get a collection of records. And I feel like the bigger the collection it gets, the less exclusive. And then, then, then I'd feel, because like I'm such a music nerd, I'd be like, oh, I've got that record, so I must have this one now. And it, lo it looked like I would just end up throwing money at it and never listening to them. So it seemed kind of silly to start a vinyl collection. Also, I think, I think it's much more environmentally friendly to do things digitally. I've just realised we can craft some more seats. We are really starting to pump through these now. We need to keep on top of making them. Um, <laughs> and I keep walking back over here and forgetting every single time. We were looking for this, actually. So we want to make a lumber axe. We need four parts, and we want to make it unbreaking from the beginning. So if we make everything we can out of uh, paper, I believe that is the way to go. So let's grab our paper. Let's bring... Oh, let's get some more paper, actually. Let's bring those little boxes we got down below up here. Why is everybody asking about Season 5? They thought this season is bad. I think there are still lots of possibilities, says Mr. Crater. Yeah, I mean, like, Minecraft is endless, right? Like, there ain't nothing stopping you from doing more in this game. Okay, we're going to take those things up top of us now, so we can craft stuff easier. Swiss Piplup says, Morning X, I haven't been on for a long while, but I'm back again. Welcome back, buddy. And Zahul says, what plans do you have for Season 5 of Hermitcraft? Any new Hermits in mind? Uh, I mean, we've got to wait another week until we can start Season 5. I'm sure someone's going to mention it, so I don't know I don't know when Season 5 is going to happen, to be fair. At this rate, people talk about it so much, we'll never get to start it. Uh, let's go throw down this thing over here. And part builder will be that. Yep, that's all good. So, again, what was the lumber axe? Now, they're the bigger rods and the bigger binding. Part builder, wait a minute. I feel like I'm... Did I, did I leave one down there? Isn't there, like, the pattern maker? No, I didn't leave one. I feel like we're missing something. Let's type in... Uh, no, pattern maker is that one? Pattern chest. Am I am I doing something stupid here? Am I being silly? That's our chest. This is our part builder. That's just a crafty. Yeah, there's there's another there's another tinkers thing that we're missing. And it is not on that page. <laughs> stencil table. Hello. That's what a hi. Where's my stencils at? Let's get a stencil in here. Thank you very much. That's the one that we need. People are saying in your inv Oh my goodness me, it's literally in my inventory. What a derp! J people, we've had our first derp of the day. Can we get some derp faces in chat? Did I derp last stream? I don't think I did, you know. But uh, that was that was a definite derp moment. I mean, I can't... I've got no excuses really, have I? I've been caught red-handed. <laughs> I, can't, I can't get myself out of this one. Uh, let's have a look. Right, there is a tough tool rod. There is a binding that is also tough. We can even make that out of paper. And then we can make the head out of it as well, right? That's a broad axe head. I believe that's what we need. We can make all the parts out of uh, paper. Which I'm not sure is a great idea, but it might work. Thank you for all the derp faces. It's nice to see that in chat. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to have a, uh, a tea reminder thanks to Sir Classington. Thank you, my friend. Let's have a sip. Mmm. Oh, that's uh, that's delicious. Rock the chocolate says repair your AOIT. Well, we'll do it when it needs repairing, man. Don't worry about it. Right, let's uh, let's craft some parts. You know what I'm saying? So there's the heads. I don't know if we're actually going to use like every single bit here. Let's see. Let's see how it goes. Right, I doubt one is going to be enough there. So we need even more paper. This thing is so expensive. All this paper it's costing us. I mean, what does it expect? 
Uh, Bas das Bastiv says, yo, is there a way to get instant alerts on my phone whenever X starts doing Sky Factory streams? Really enjoy that stuff. Well, I tweet, I upload a video and Twitch will notify you. Beyond that, I don't really have a suggestion. Not a suggestion at all, really. Need like a need like an app that properly notifies you. Let's you, let you catch your favourite streamers and all that. Okay, so if we chuck this thing in here, let's have a look at what it's going to give us. Five modifiers is exactly what we want. It's going to be a very slow mining speed. And the mining level is stone. Now what's interesting with that is that it's only ever going to do wood. So in theory that would work just fine, right? Peeps, I'm going to let you brain smarties out there who know all about the Tinker's Tools and what I'm trying to do. Uh, have a moment to send me a message and say, wait a minute, don't use that because we might be doing it wrong. Uh, but we want to make it unbreaking. And Valerie says seems good. It seems good to me as well. But we got a donation here, noise in the ear from Wuyi Rock T Avluan. This Rocky, this is getting out of hand now. These these names are getting all sorts of crazy. It says uh, had silver needle Dragon Ball tea yesterday, and it was great. I'm really into Eastern teas lately. Though I always keep stocked up on a few common Western varieties. Tai Guan is like my Eastern Assam, a good anytime tea. I highly recommend trying it. Rocky, you are a uh, tea expert by the sounds of it. Tea expert. Appreciate the nation as always. Uh, I'm going to be on the lookout for more teas um, when I go shopping, that's for sure. Uh, I've got those, I've got that Dal Darjeeling, is it? I forget how to say it. And. Uh, the Lap Sal Chong Chu. Oh dear, I'm butchering that one. Yeah, I got those ones to get through. Hey, those items look cool. <laughs> I've got those ones to get through. And when we've done that, I will buy some more. But it all depends on what the shop has. The shop usually just has the same sort of things. I was actually quite surprised to find some other flavours recently because it's not what they usually stock up. And uh, I think the China Rose and Moroccan Mint I really did like. Okay, so we want five in total, which means eight, sorry, ten. Ten of these suckers, you know. Nine! A apparently, no, we need nine, it says. I love cats, says Rockypedia. I love that, that's great. Uh, also, Swiss Piplup has, uh, is here resubscribing for seven months in a row. Thank you so much, my friend, appreciate that. Mm. By the way, we're approaching 800 people watching. Thank you everyone for tuning in. Really do appreciate that. I hope you enjoy today's stream. And if you're not following me here on Twitch, what are you doing? Hit that follow button, man. It's free. <laughs> Mr. Creator says, as a Chinese, a Sam is better than Tai Guan Yin for me. That sounds weird. As a Chinese, is that... Like... what? What's the English equivalent of saying Chinese? Like, I think it's just English. Yeah, it is. But I wouldn't say as an English. You'd say as an Englishman or as a Englander. <laughs> I don't know. I don't, I'm not. I'm not great at language. It just sounded funny to me. Mr. Sheep says Moroccan mint. Yes, that was the one that I tried. It was really nice. At first, I was like, "Oh, like this one's." I don't think this one's going to be my cup of tea. I mean, excuse the pun. We're talking about tea. Uh, but I was thinking this. This probably ain't for me. And then it grew on me very quickly. As a Chinaman, says Rocky Avalon. Yeah, that that would sound right to me. But hey, like it doesn't really matter. I'm just, uh, <laughs> it's just I don't know. It just sounded funny, interesting to me. Didn't I say I'd make a clay farm this stream as well? We should. When we do that, we should probably up the obsidian stream, right? Oh yeah, we want five. What am I doing? We'll have five. Thank you. All right, get upgradeified. What? That's what it's called, upgradeified. So we put five of these in. Oh yes, and now that thing is unbreakable. And I believe there was a uh, call to make an unbreakable tool in there, so we get to slap that on. Um, here you go, mate. Oh, oh, you did it! That was sweet. That was. Hey, I haven't even hooked up the interface yet. Hang on a minute. What do I need to? I need to export. I don't think I actually need to. I could send it bone meal. That's the one thing I could send it, and I don't want it running fast. So for now, actually, I think what we're going to do is just use the export cable, you know? I don't think we need to make it any more complicated, really. Hang says, gotta love that durable paper. I know, right? It's the most durable tool in the game. 
It is a bit weird that they made something like modifiers come from paper. So we want an importer. Please make us one. Also, we can probably, I'm guessing we can probably make, yep, we can make more seeds. Wow. It's starting to get a little bit ridiculous, I reckon. Have we got enough? Yeah, we have. Right, let's get on planting that down. Uh, your everyday Twitch says X, you should, you should have used magic wood to make it unbreakable. It also gives you more modifiers of paper. Aha, but how do we make magic woods? Heard about this. Ah, uh, that's not too bad actually, is it? Anyway, we've done that now. If we need to make another Tinker's Tool in the future, we'll consider that. And it's something we do actually need to do in the future. I was trying to make an importer. There we go. I also don't have my cables on me. How did they get away from me? Mr. Sheep says, oh my god, the puns are unstoppable. They are? What puns am I making now? I can't even keep track of them. Hi, that's the wrong thing. There we go, importer. Cable, there we go. And uh, we'll just zap it along to this thing. Oh, there we go. I've got to sort of avoid the lag a little bit here as I place this. Nice. Right, so that thing's hooked up. It's got no seeds, but it don't need some. It's got saplings. Dude, and check it out. It is, uh, it's got the apple. Let's give this thing an upgrade and see if the items uh, get pulled out of there faster. So we'd like a stack upgrade and a capacitor, I reckon. Aha, we need an octodaic. We need it on the stat, on the double. Uh, we got a resubscribe for 10 months in a row from GBV. Thank you so much for resubscribing, my friend. I hope you enjoyed today's stream. I Luke Katz, does anyone here know there's a way to get more modifiers on Tinker's Tool and Sky Factory? Apparently, Magic Wood is the way to do it. Uh, Goody Man says, hey X, I think you should use a hatchet. It's cheaper to make. Well, we've now made this. So, if it's cheaper or not, I guess we've got this to work with now, right? Okay, down below, we need that upgrade. And then those things should get zapped out of there and we should have an apple in the system. Oh, look at that. It's putting them over there, is it? Huh. You shouldn't be doing that. Right, let's configure this thing for the... Hey, is my magnet not picking up those blocks? Didn't we, didn't we encounter this before, that it, it doesn't suck up some types of items? By the way, the blue here is just ridiculous. It doesn't fit in the slightest and I don't care. There should be a death message for the paper thing. Died from a paper cut, says Hang. <laughs> yeah, on paper tools, that would be pretty cool, wouldn't it? I like that idea. Should really get that platform below this thing built as well. For now though, this will do. Uh, make your shuriken unbreakable, says Egg. Egg J. Um... Where are we at with it now? No modifiers. We're 500 out of 1,000 XP, so we've got to keep leveling it up. I bet you what, I bet you some of this lag is from all of this down here. Why does that one, like, not want to suck it up? That's... Ugh. Should be in a good enough position to get the XP. I don't know what's going on with that. It's full up, look. So the fluid can't go down. This one is also full up but yet there's no XP down the bottom. Didn't we didn't we do this already? Don't I need to put like a fluid conduit here? Let's try that. We did no, we did an Ender IO tank, I think. Let's do the Ender IO tank. Apparently shift equals no magnet. Ah, oh, okay, so I was holding down shift, right. I think you all told me that before. Let's Ha, ah, and that time I picked it up. Excellent. Right, we're gonna need more of those stone blocks. We're going to need um, an Ender IO tank as well. Let's see if we've got any. Uh, let's do it down here. Tank. There it is. We want one of those. Thank you very much. And we should be good. Yat says X. What do you think about nuclear weaponry or military nuclear ambitions? Wow, what a heavy and extensive topic. I think I think nukes are bad, and I think we all know it. 
but there's this this crazy idea of like you know once one person's got a nuke you've got to have a nuke i mean what we should do is give every person on this planet a nuclear warhead and that will solve all problems you know because then no one will nuke each other will they yeah it sounds mental right <laughs> Uh, so let's go down here. Let's not talk about nuclear warheads today. Anyone else thinking about food? I'm hungry. Lol, says, uh, says AM4692. Anyone who read your message is thinking about it. I mean, I'm thinking about food. But I'm thinking about food because you just made me think about food. Do you know what I mean? Do you know what I'm saying? Right. Hi. I held down shift. That was a bad idea. But it probably picked it up and put it in the system. Yeah. Cool. That thing is now transferring XP. Stinky says, Asuma, make a nanobot meat beacon from environmental tech with saturation so you never have to eat. That sounds like a really great idea, to be fair. There it is. There is our ender tank. We're going to go put that down below. Right, please pick up the XP. Yes, it's sucking up the XP. That's great. So this thing goes on the side and then it transfers to it. Push. Push that XP, that delicious XP out the side. Is it doing that? I feel like it's not pushing to this thing. It's not, is it? Look. What if I use push pull? Peeps, what do you make of that? I don't know. I don't know what to make of that. Arangelo says, no, 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 no. Oprah Neon is doper. I tried to install Oprah Neon and it just didn't work. It's just like the installer just freezes. I was like, oh, not wasting my time with this then, jeez. Okay, what we got over here? We've got the southeast quadrant next. Southeast, that'll be this one here, which we'll do oak trees on. So in theory, it should plant it down on that immediately. That one can reach that corner. This one can reach that one. Maybe, maybe there'll be a little bit of time before it figures out it's going to put it there. And we really don't need to figure anything else out, actually. What we need to do... Ah, well, I need to know which one is northeast, okay? I'm guessing it's this one. West, north... Actually, it's this one here. This one will have four. There it goes. Right, let's put that one down. That's very good. So we're going to grow these trees in one by ones and those ones in two by twos. And they'll just sit here and do their thing passively over time. And when they do so, uh, it means we get some apples. Let's see if we've got any apples in the system. It's a lot of work to get some apples, wasn't it? Let's also look at our essence situation. 905. Hi. Am I pressing the wrong button? No. Let's put another one of those down, man. I was looking at this and thinking, it kind of looks like a lot of them finished growing and this thing can't keep up. So maybe if you've got a smaller farm, it would work better. And I don't think there's a way to work faster, but what do you guys think? Look at this. Like, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Like, 11 of them fully grown and sitting there. So you can see it goes in rows, but maybe if this area was smaller, it might do a better job of harvesting them quicker, if that makes sense. Turn the wheel on the ender tank, says Super Xander. Thank you, Super Xander. I believe we did that before, didn't we? I think we did that before. Let's give it a turn. Let's see what happens. Oh, no, it's working now. Hey, look, that thing is now diamond. It wasn't before. I think we got it. I think it fixed itself. <laughs> anyway, we've got a noise in the ear. Donation here from Rocky Core <laughs> No Lava Avalon saying. But these are ridiculous now. By the way, did you ever check out that band I sent you? Was wondering what you think of gimmicky bands like that. I really enjoy the theatrical music, so they're right up my street. Uh, plus, I like their vibe. Hashtag Season Forever. Which band is that? I um, I have no idea, Rocky. I have no idea. People send me music all the time, and I listen to all of it. And um, yeah, like without knowing what band it was you sent me, I don't know. <laughs> Uh, but appreciate the donation as always, buddy. Aloba says, well, X, I have to get ready for the concert. I might be able to get back on the stream later, at, but if I don't, wish me luck, buddy. Dude, I bet you I won't be streaming when the concert's over. I mean, a concert ain't over in, like, you know, a couple of hours, is it? It's a long it's a long thing. You've got to get there. The, you know, three or four bands are going to play, and... Yeah, I, I won't be streaming when you get back, man. I'm pretty sure of that. <laughs> 
Swiss Piplop says, X, take a gulp of tea. It's going cold. Oh, jeez, I will do. Sorry. Sorry, sir. Let's let's take a gulp. Mmm. Mmm. Why are some of these things different? Oh, they're tanks that just are made out of different things. Interesting. Right, let's have a look in our book because we're going to do the Supremium Apple. I believe there was also... Right, Age of Power, maybe further up here. Well, I took. Maybe it was actually behind where we were looking. No, we've done all of this stuff. I could have swore there was one just over here. I looked at it earlier. Create an unbreakable Tinker's Tool. There it is. That's pretty cool. Craft the highest tier unbreakable builder's one. That sounds like something we'd like. So let's have a look at that. Unbreakable ones. That one will be the one. Is that it? Is that it? Are you kidding me? Oh, we got to kill another wither. Should we kill another wither? Um, Camo says you missed my donation. I didn't. I didn't miss it, buddy. I can see it. I just. I always. I'm terrible. I know. I always take my time getting around to reading them because there's so many things to distract me, man. There's all these sparkly things going on. Uh, let's go stone as well. I need to remember to finish off that platform. And I think that'll be important as well, because when the trees grow, they'll drop down lighting updates, you know. Oh, one just grew. That's a big one. That is a big old tree. I wonder if we can see it getting harvested, like one of the blocks being used on the axe. The axe is unbreakable and it gets XP as well, so we can perhaps give it fortune or I don't know if that would help actually. Bam, there it goes. And I believe it's collected all the saplings itself. That's really good. That is really good. So we'll have some apples coming in here uh, so we can make that Supremium apple, but we were going to go fight a wither. Distractions. What did I tell you, peeps? Supremium apple, donation and wither. Okay, so... Oh, wait a minute. Which apple did it actually want? Sup Supremium. Supremium. Which is that one. Right. Uh, we'll come back to that in a bit. Let's read this donation. Uh, Camo District is here with a noise in the ear saying, Hey X, enjoying the stream tonight here in New Zealand, doing some computer work for school. While watching you helps me get a lot done. Keep up the great work. Thank you, buddy. I appreciate it very much. I hope I don't distract you too much with the derpiness and make you make mistakes. Rocky Avalon says, we eat three river skulls and 48 soul sand. Should I be scared, says Rocky. We're going to make a mega a mega wither. Is that okay? A mega wither it is. Yeah, I just I counted one. I didn't count the others. Hi, so I remember how to do this. I think. Right, let's not... Let's not... Ugh. If I get this wrong, I'm going to scream and run away. No, I got it right. Thank goodness. Thank goodness. Otherwise, we'd have been in trouble, you know. It's a ghast wither. Wow. <laughs> That's my kind of wither. Cuplex says English with X. Supremium. It's a Supremium one. Oh, wow. That is menacing looking. I'm just going to stand here and do this. Actually, we should do it like one hit at a time. Wow, that thing is loud, man. Be quiet, you going to be dead soon anyway. Wow, that is disgustingly loud. And now it's not taking any damage because we've got to use me. Dude, this is this is nuts. I mean, I'm sorry, but that's too much, right? You can see its health slowly going down. Whacking it with this thing is certainly helping. There we go. If we use that thing though. Nah, it doesn't really affect its, its health at all. Sweet. See you later, you smelly ghast. Or wither. <laughs> I'm not sure which one you are. There we go. Hey, we also got a crumb, a crumb star. It's got a little Steve face in it. What's going on there? I don't know. I don't know, but we're going to get out of here now. Hello, chicken. Lay some redstone for us. Also, let's put our sound back up. Aluv Cat says a Mega Wither of Doom and a Destruction. And Destruction, yep, that's that's what we were going to make. 
Thank goodness we didn't. Uh, we've got a new subscriber here. It's Joe Plain Jordan. Thank you for subscribing to the channel. Appreciate you. I kind of blend into the nether portal a little bit, don't I? That's what I do. Uh, White's Paladin says there's a block that silences the Wither Boss and another for the End Dragon. And that. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I know what you're on about. Yes, I've seen those. We should probably put one of those there is what you're trying to hint at, isn't it? Uh, but we would need to fight another one because I'm going to use this one for our wands. Where is it? Tier 3, Unbreakable Wands or, or whatever. So what do the other ones cost? They all cost the same thing. Oh, wait a minute. Right, so 4096. Ah! No, we're going to need like four of those, aren't we? For that. So we need to kill four Withers. Right. I think I know what I want to do now. I want to repair my AOIT. I also want to put sharpness on it. Can you dig it? Which one's sharpness? I'm looking in the wrong place. <laughs> totally distracted. Uh, Ender crystal for soul bound. What looks like it would be sharpness? I think quartz is sharpness. Oh yes it is. We're going to need a lot of quartz. How much do we have? I don't think... Oh no, we do have plenty. Well that's good. Uh, book and quill. Thank you very much. And lapis. Yes please. Right. Also, inventory be full of all sorts of thingies. And we've got to make that apple at some point. Okay, so... I believe... That will give us what we want. Oh yes, and 36 levels of XP. Very nice. Cool, we're going to put that on the AOT. We're going to grab a diamond to repair it as well. Um, let's have a look. So, this thing with, with sharpness 5... <gasps> No, we can't put it on. We need a sword weapon. That's what we need now. Oh, it only costs one level, but I don't have enough XP. Acoustic Thunder says, kill it before it lays eggs. What what thing should we kill before it lays eggs? I'm confused. Alright, that'll do for now. Okay, and things here can probably just get put back into there. Right, so we're gonna need we're gonna need four of these in total. So why don't we make a wither sound thing? Oh, it's only a skull. Wow. Okay, we need three of them then. Let's get some more of those skulls. Okay, let's go do this, man. Let's go farm some withers and put that thing on top of it. It only muffles the death though. I'm slightly alarmed by that. Sir Classington says, oh, you got rid of the crumb star. What do we use the crumb star for, man? I'll get another one. Don't worry about it. I mean, but what do we use it for, you know? Do you know what I'm saying? Right, let's put that up there. <laughs> he's got his headphones on, man. He's listening to some sweet tunes. That's what he's doing. Okay, right. Here we go. Hi. What one are you? Yeah, Jabams. Okay. I don't think this is going to help. This is going to stop the noise for the rest of the server, isn't it? Sir Classington says, favourite pizza. Oh, I do like pizza. <laughs> I have one every now and then. Uh, I'm not a fan of, like, Pizza Hut or... Ooh, you shouldn't be able to hit me. Maybe that block on the top there is disrupting it, actually. Well, this is going to get all noisy up in here real soon, peeps, so watch out. Okay, we're at the halfway point. He's going ham. I need to eat food. Oh, my ears. My poor old ears. Yeah, I don't, I don't have a pe like a favourite pizza, but I like barbecue sauce and I like like chili cheese or something like that. Okay, he's withering me. I've got to be careful here, but we're getting his health down as well. Take that sucker! You're almost dead now. Okay, yeah, that'll do. It's time to eat. <laughs> Come on now. Right, let's go get a uh, sound muffler this time. So what do I do with the head crumbs thing? You eat the crumb star, says Cuplex. Oh, no flint and steel. Oh. <laughs> uh, how do we get back, peeps? I mean, we could kill ourselves. Uh, we've got a bit of a problem. Is FTB Utils on here? There we go. I like pineapple on my pizza. Let the hate roll in, says Power Crank. I like pineapple on pizza. It's nice. 
Okay, so we want a sound muffler now. I think that means we need a note block. Hi, and then... That was the second derp of the stream. I know, peeps. I hear ya. I hear ya. That was our second. Hey, wait a minute. I had the ender pouch. No flint and steel in the ender pouch. Uh, Rutgerber says, just coming here to say hi. Hello, you. How's it going? The Iron Wolf says, hey, X. I just joined. What I miss? We're just, we're just cranking out some achievements at the moment. Uh, let's have a look. I need to type in flint. And then I need to type in steel. And then I need to realise that actually it's not steel, it's iron that we need. Because for some reason, that's called flint and steel, you know? I mean, it makes total sense, but who's complaining? Hi, we need to get those things processed. Glad I noticed them. Right, how is this thing doing over here? Uh-oh, I never enabled it again, did I? Oh, are you kidding me? I literally never enabled it again. I mean... Wait a minute, extract. The level of derp here, what is going on? I've left that in there. Right. That's kind of bad. This is backed up beyond belief now, probably. Ah, it's not terrible. Anyway, we'll, we'll dump that in there for now. Rocky Avalon says, now you're going to generate another portal. That, do you know what? It might generate... No, it'll generate another one, won't it? Ah, this game's never easy. <laughs> I, like, I like that. That's really cool. We're keeping that. That's going to be our double portal. And uh, I'm going to take four of these. Thank you very much. <laughs> Double portal. That's great. It's because this thing attacked us. So let's also... Let's move the location of this, by the way. Let's put that there. Oh! I changed your eyes, man! How did that happen? Let's put that there. So when we put it down, it's... I'm going to do that and see what happens. Okay, right, uh, we're going to fight our second, third, third one. We've got to do four in total. There you go, this one is... Uh, I don't think we get to see a name yet. All right, let's not go where the portals are. Also, my shuriken is running a little bit low. Okay, that, that wrecked some, uh, <laughs> some zombie pigmen. Hi, why can't we see your health with a crumb? No name. No name on this one. Wait a minute. Is it because I did this? I don't know. There it is. Yeah. Ah! You can make the bar appear or disappear. Well, that's cool. That's a cool option, actually. It's a very cool option. Start whacking this guy with the A-I-O-T. Sunglasses on with us, says Sir Classington. It's all that lava, man. It's blinding their eyes. Hangsner says X. Uh, please, X, craft more. Just craft, craft, craft. You want me to craft? What? It's like, that's not the name of this game, is it? Jeez. This game's about building. No, I'm joking. It's about mining. And not crafting. Okay, what one is this? Cow. We got a cow wither in the house. Hanging out, being a cow. Also a wither. I mean, what kind of milk is that thing going to make? You know? Some weird milk. <laughs> that's what we call it. Weirdo milk. Uh, I.E. Ken says, Hey X, when do you think we will get an episode around this stage of the mod pack? Oh, there'll be no episodes. This is just a streaming world, man. Like, the the series I do on YouTube, that's with Rendog. That's a different world. This is just this is just my, uh, my play in the game world, you know. A streaming. Cuplex says moo. <laughs> It'd be great if it were making moo sounds, but we can't hear anything. In fact, didn't I turn my sound down? So let's turn it back up just so we can get a sense of... Uh... No, it still makes a fair bit of noise, doesn't it? But not as much, because it's muffled. Hi. Get wrecked, young cow wither. <laughs> I think that's my favourite wither so far. Hey! Hey, look at that. We're now accustomed. Wait thing is better. We have one modifier. So we want to get we want to get this thing all the way down. It's durability down. It's at 29. When it goes down a little bit further... All right, get wrecked. Get wrecked, guy. It means it's going to do more damage, and then we're going to make it unbreakable when it's lower. So it's at 29 still. Let's go back to our base. Best not to ask about the milk, says the Endless. Yeah, don't ask about that. <laughs> Onyx Snow says soul milk. 
And Yi Jaryong says, Shuken Breaking Alert. Thank you for the Shuriken Breaking Alert. It's good to know that you care, man, about the Shuriken. Hi, little little chicken gonna be for uh, the Shuriken to level up. We are down to 20... Oh, we're still at 29. Well, wow. We've got to go a little further, I think. Why can we get some mobs? Like, here we can. Let's slap that. I wonder if... You know we went to the nether and we couldn't find our nether portal. I think that's because we went there on the wrong account. X, are you planning to get into reactors, says the Holy Saint MC. Um, yeah, I thought about extreme reactors and I thought, you know what, we're not gonna we're not gonna do extreme reactors. I can't be bothered to craft those things, put them together in a weld and connect them up to, you know, a refined storage system and power systems. Not gonna bother with that. I'm being sarky, is that alright? I don't mean anything by it. Uh, Blockhead Minion says, X, what will you change when you hit one million subscribers? I will change the world. I will make it completely and utterly different. Okay, I'm gonna turn it upside down. Uh, I don't, I don't know quite what you mean by what am I gonna change. I mean, I don't know. I ain't really got, I ain't really got any plans other than just keep doing what I do, enjoy, enjoy doing what I do. And you are an enriched mineral log. Have we found something special here? Why are you enriched with the crystallized mineral chunk? Hello, what is the recipe? Oh, what is it? What is it good for? Absolutely nothing. It's just a block. <laughs> okay, well that's the thing we discovered. I wonder if we got our apple yet. We need to make recipes to do the apple thing. Which is a part of today's stream. We must do that. Apparently I need to right click on the wither crumb. We're going to do that in a different dimension, of course. And now what we want are some sticks. Yes, please. We are going to create four of those. Then we put two of them together. They make the next one up. We put two of them together. They make the next one up. We put two of them together. They make the ultimate one. Bam! We've just done an achievement. We did that. We can get rid of that thing now. We got an unbreakable wand, peeps. It is amazing. It's going straight in the ender pouch and we're going to forget that it exists, okay? No, no, we won't forget. Um, hi. What are we looking for? That thing that we've got to tick? Where is it? Craft the highest unbreakable wheels ones. We did that. Add a diamond hammer to Tinker's pickaxe to obtain... The smashing modifier. Some extra like Tinker's bits and bobs here basically, isn't there? Menril, what's that good for? Well, torches, says I look at. Is it? Sir Clarsonton says I have the crazy urge to listen to 80s powers ballad. Give in to that urge and enjoy it. Okay, let's have a look. I, I, might, I might just tick that off at some point because it's kind of like we can fly down there. Use a diamond transporter to bring home five blaze spawners. Nah, we can do that, but it'd be grindy. So traveling to the beneath is another thing. Let's get this uh, apple put together, man, you know. So premium apple. We need... Aha, we've got eight recipes. So there's one. You are the supreme... Wait. Superium. That's the supremium. I mean, this is going to get confusing quickly. Which requires the intermedium. Who, who is it who requested some crafting? Now you're getting what you asked for. The Prudient Apple, I think, is the next one we want. Okay, then we go all the way down to the Infernium Apple. Hi, and now we've got everything we need. So, let's go chuck those. We'll put uh, you in there. That one in here. One over there. Another in that one. And that one's full up. So, we'll go back to uh, that one there. Cool. Right. Let's tell the machine that we're hungry and we'd like to eat a very, a very special apple. Uh, this one right here. Do we have what we need? We can override that. Yeah. Yeah, we got it. Sweet. Let's do it. I'm down. Down like a clown, Charlie Brown. Okay. Uh, hi. Can we see it crafting? I think we can if we do that. It's doing stuff, peeps. Uh, we got a donation here from rock underscore e underscore avalon saying use mineral berries in place of coal slash charcoal to craft special torches. Also in the band name was a forest of stars. I actually didn't get around to checking them out Rocky. I think uh, tweet it at me like Twitter's the way that I can sit there and then go aha let's load that thing up or whatever. Yeah I forgot to check them out man. I was sorry about that. Uh, but appreciate the donation as always. How do we use these to make torches. Ooh, oh, that's a logic cable. 
There's a wrench. And a variable card. A labeler. <laughs> this is this is some other sort of integrated dynamics. This is just some other sort of mod I was unaware of. A proxy, a materializer. Output variable transformer. And no signs of a torch. Interesting. Uh, Joe Plain Jordan says my second and third messages after subbing got deleted. Wow, I'm brand new. Haha. <laughs> well, that one didn't get deleted. Well done, my friend. You successfully avoided the thing that deletes. Whatever that is. Nightbot, probably. Um, right. We've done fighting with us. We've got to go do the crumb star thing. So we're going to go over to uh, the nether to do that. Hey, wait. No, no. We never finished this as well. Hi. Piggies get wrecked. It's time for you to upgrade this shuriken. I just realised, I think we don't have to really kill anything. We're killing stuff... <gasps> no, 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 wait, 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 wait. It's got durability 9. Okay, it's not broken. If we make it unbreakable now, it's perfect. I just realised that all we had to do was use it. We didn't actually have to hit anything with it. So, for this final stage, we need some gold. Two pieces of gold. And we're going to go smelt that in the smeltery. By the way, approaching 900 people watching today. Thank you everyone for tuning in. I hope you're having a great Saturday morning. Or some other time of day, depending on where you are. And uh, welcome. Creeper Development says you make the torch with the berries. The berries? We didn't get any berries from that tree. Jeez. Couplex says, did you figure out the null charm yet? Just press R when hovering over things and read the info tab. R is recipes. That's not the null charm. R is the recipe for something. Oh wait, no, read the info tab. Where's the info tab? I don't see an info tab, man. I don't know what you're on about. Supreme Pizza. Wow, that sounds lovely. Hi, uh, did you make gold? You did. We need that down here now. Sir Classington says, good start to Saturday morning. I agree, I like, I like streaming on a Saturday morning. I've got to go for a run, I've got to clean the house, I've got to... I got to record an episode of Hermitcraft, man. This week has been has been riddled with stuff taking up my time, and I really don't like recording videos under pressure anymore. Like under this one needs to come out in a few days, kind of thing. And now, now it's like today I've got other things to do, and I'm going to be stretched to get my video done in time. I don't know. It's just like. I don't want to be recording it on the day that I release it, right? Because then it's like, hey, I want to do all these things, but now I've got to get them done before this sort of time. And uh, it just takes the fun out of it. Okay. Uh, you are now unbreakable, but you're also empty. Nah, this isn't the way to do it. I'm glad I thought. I'm glad my brain kicked in and went, wait a minute, X. Wait a minute. Stop being an idiot. Oi, listen to me for once, you. I'm telling you something about this. You're doing it wrong. Right. We're not doing it wrong anymore because that thing went empty, even though it still had durability. So uh, I don't even need to—I don't even need to fly over there to where the mobs are. The point I was going to make is that the durability is 150, 152. Now it's 142, and we can see it on the side of our screen. So all I need to do, I think, is get this down to like 20 or 10. Okay, does that thing update slow? I think you sort of fire them off. Actually, it's got a different number on the side of the screen to what it's got here. No, it doesn't. Wait, I'm confused. Right, 80. Oh, it's because I pick them back up. What? That's a thing with durability? I guess then. So if you shoot and... Oh, I am learning things constantly. I can't stop learning. Compress sheep, we love you. Right. 153. Oh, <laughs> that was funny. Now we got 152. Because there's no shuriken to pick up, right? I think that's how it works. So... If I fire these down here and don't walk into them again like I was doing. 152. Now, now why isn't it... Okay, what is going on? Like, why are they not going down? I'm so confused. <laughs> I thought this would be simple. Somehow I'm just not getting what's going on here. Maybe we shoot them into the voids? I mean... <laughs> Hey, now the number's going down, because they're going into the void. Mr. Creator says, so just don't release it. We want quality over quantity. Well, no, I have to keep my schedule going. Look, uh, I've explained this many times before. There's, there's one approach which is like, I'll do what I want when I want. 
And there's another approach which is like, well, if I do that, if I do what I want when I want, then this YouTube thing that we're doing, which is amazing, I love doing, won't won't be a thing if you don't take it seriously. Might sound strange, right? I'm not going any lower than 12. That's perfect. Might sound strange, but I don't know how to explain it really. So let's say playing games was your job, right? But the reason that playing games was your job was because on the platform where you put your videos or whatever, it's successful. People like it. They watch it. Now, if you don't take that part of it seriously, if you're like, oh, I'll just do what I want, then that part of it might not be here and then it might not be your job. So the deal is you got to be smart. you got to do YouTube properly. you got to, you know, make your make your videos or whatever on a schedule. You've got to make them good quality. And that means you'll be able to keep doing this. You'll be able to keep playing this game because you're making good content on the platform and then the platform works well for you. You've got to remember, YouTube isn't a fair system. YouTube, YouTube isn't going to like, if you just decided, hey, I'm going to go make a video on Minecraft. YouTube isn't going to go, here's viewers, you know. Like, you have to you have to find those viewers. You have to craft an audience or, or whatever, you know. You have to find a niche. And then you have to keep keep the quality up and keep doing it well. So, there, there's an exchange here, right? You know, you, you can't just do what you want and expect that to work. So, so I will always stick to having things run on a schedule. For those of you that can pick out the schedule, the videos are there when you know they're going to be. For those of you that don't, it just means that without realizing it, you watch stuff consistently. You know, every every day, every other day or whatever, and that's that's good for YouTube system. Right, enough about YouTube. Crumb star time. Hello. Let's 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 face the music, man. I'm right clicking on it and nothing's happening. What's going on? On the ground? No, wait, we're eating it. Hi. Uh anticlimactic. Was that it? Was that really it? Je oh. Man, I thought that was gonna be so much better. I love audiences. Craft an audience. How am I craftable? You are craftable, man. If I put I love cats next to the Rocky Avalon, it will give me a uh, a make it rain. Do you know what I mean? No, I'm joking. Um Long Cry says, what about EFO then? I mean, great point, really. But here's, here's what I think is so fascinating about EFO is it shows the power of what he's doing. Like, he's on another level. Like, he's just naturally so much better at making uh, Minecraft videos and, and finding people that are interested in how he does them that he can do even less of that YouTube stuff. You've you got to remember, like, I'm not someone who clickbaits and, you know, does all of these... SEO videos. I mean, I do do some on YouTube, but I do things that I'm interested in. I'm not someone who chases it down. Um, and there will be some people out there that have to do that to survive, right? So, if you've if you've just got this, you know, absolute natural ability to be really great at making videos, like someone like Evo does, that can compensate for the amount of YouTubing that he has to do. He doesn't have to do thumbnails, he doesn't have to do all of this stuff, right? But let's say let's say he wasn't as good as he is at making videos, then he could achieve the same status of channel by doing all of the things like thumbnails and schedules, playlists, etc, etc, right? Does that make sense to you guys? I feel like I'm talking to myself. <laughs> just looking at chat and everyone else is just talking about something else. So Classington says, Assumer, I like watching your streams, etc. Because it is like you're one of us just trying to love and play the game. Yeah, yeah, that is, that is what it is. Like, that's streaming so much more casual than YouTube, you know. Anyway, it's what I'm doing on YouTube, right? I'm playing my favourite game. I'm just... On YouTube, it's not the same as Twitch. Twitch is very much like turn up and play, right? That's literally the, the premise. So you're given so much more leeway on Twitch than you are compared to YouTube, right? Have you ever heard of Andrew? <laughs> Says I.E. Ken. I mean, yeah, I've heard of several Andrews. Which one? Should we get all the Andrews and you can point out which one you mean? I mean, there's a lot of people called Andrew. <laughs> There's probably this. I bet you're right. We've got 900 people watching. I don't know what how popular Andrew is a name, but I'm going to guess there's at least three Andrews watching, maybe. Maybe that's a bit too optimistic. Hi. Uh, oh, no, I couldn't quite click on the apple. There's the apple. Bam, we got it. Do we eat it? I don't think we'll eat it just yet. Maybe we should save it for going to the beneath, which is where we've got to go to next. However, where is that Supremium apple? Right. Uh, Supremium armor comes after this. Let's have a look at that as well. So... 
Need to make Supremium ingots. Don't I already know how to make those? I do. How much do you cost? I think... I think I think that price is distorted because we're currently crafting something else at the moment. So let's wait for that. Uh, Swiss Piplup says, "How would one craft one's own EFO?" I'm asking for a friend. I don't even know. No one knows. Probably to craft an EFO, you probably put some stone slabs at the top, then a line of TNT, and then a line of redstone below it. Something like that. There you go. Wolf Dances says, "Beneath Dimension is just." It's just silly fun. Yeah, yeah, I get the impression. I've been to the Beneath before, I think. I get the impression it's like that. Hi. Oh, that's a pattern. I was going to say, I'm surprised we have all of these blocks. Oh, you got to do compressed cobble, do you? Well, hey, i got a project idea, right? Let's get some compacting drawers. We got them. We got them. Oh, we've also got compressed cobblestone. Well, that'll get us started. Let's get some compacting drawers. We might need more. So, what is the, the recipe? The recipe? Why are you talking silly? Okay, compacting. Hi, I clicked down here. What happened? So we get one of those, bam, and uh, we need. Then we need like Ender IO. Oh, every time, <laughs> every time we need conduits. We need item filters. Oh yes, we do. Item filters. So they'll compact. We'll move the items with those. That will filter it, and then. We just need some cobblestone generators, I believe. Hi. Uh, Stux Advisor says, Oi, X, just checked in. What you up to? We are uh, doing lots of little bits and bobs out of the book at the moment. Hi, I think we need to start off with those. That didn't work. Ha, we need buckets of lava. Nope, that won't work. There we go. Uh, so we got we got three. Let's make four in total then. Sweet. We'll put all that back in. X, what about a coffee? Not a fan. <clears throat> I love coffee. I just try to drink it as infrequently as possible. Because it is basically addictive. <laughs> I used to drink a coffee every morning and it made me feel rotten. So you've got to be careful when you drink it. It helps when you're driving, man. I had a coffee the other day when I was driving. And I went from, you know, I'm driving, I'm driving, to like, I can see everything that's going on. It was just like, I don't know, I just became one with the vehicle. No. <laughs> uh, speaking of driving, I've been practicing a lot. I hate, I hate driving so much. Like, it stresses me out. <laughs> but when you drive at night time and no one else is on the road, then it's peaceful. Just put on your favourite records, enjoy the music, and... Like, you don't have to stress out about other people on the road or anything. It's great. Okay, let's get four of those. Bam! Let's get four of these. We're going to produce a redonkulous amount of uh, cobblestone for this farm. Hey, we got four of those. And then we got four of those. Thank you very much. Right. It is time to put these to use. Where should we put this insane cobblestone generator? I don't think we're going to build it a platform. Uh, considering the janky nature of our Sky Factory world, I'm just going to slap it down over here. I think we're done trying to make, trying to pretend this could ever look pretty. Right, we're not here to, I'm not here to mess you about, man. Uh, we actually extract is what we wanted. We just needed to do that. Let's start extracting some cobble, you know. You need a lot more cobble than 26.6k, says Blazier. Oh, I know. I know we need a lot more cobble than that. I know all about compressing cobble, my friend. Believe, believe thee. Uh, so now what we want to do is insert on that channel. Uh, we could use channels here to... Yeah, channels is always good. Let's let's do this. So we insert on that channel we extract on channel brown. Okay, the thing is, channel brown will only extract a particular type. This thing should already be compacting. It is only going to do double compressed, which we have one of. Or actually I took one out of. Hi, we'd like to we'd like to make a filter. There we go. So brown is now the channel of the next one along. So we go over here. This thing is already causing lag. And we go insert out like that. Hi. Insert brown. Extract blue. So cobblestone is in there. That should not happen. Uh Sink, what? 
I think it's I think it's going too fast. Wait, this does not make sense. Hi. Right now, now let's wait for it to put something in. Double compress, quipple compress. Yep. Now it's now it's correct. Hi. Look at all the cobblestone inventory. Is it me or is this thing causing lag? Like, did it just get choppy when I put this thing down? I mean, there's only like four conduits so far. You should have cra used a tier three crafter apparently. Problem: Ender IO pipe is slow. Says Keywing. I could upgrade it. I could upgrade it. Maybe we could use crafters and put them adjacent to this. I don't know if it works like that. Is it me or is, did that just make things laggy? I don't know. X cobble generator be too fast for you, says Blockhead Minion. But I can upgrade these and make them faster, right? So what do you guys think we should use if not Ender IO conduits? The, the, the delay between the chat and him is annoying, says YWW. Eh, it can be a little bit annoying, but it's not so bad. Use compression chests, says Hermit Farm. Compression chest, compression upgrade. Is there such a thing? There was a compressed thing here. I don't see no compression chest. Chest of the compressed. Joe Plain Jordan says X. If there was an injection you could take to live in a specific amount of time longer, then would it be suicide to stop getting the injection? Uh, no, I don't think it would. But let's let's stick with this for now. So compressor says compressor. I don't think we have a compressor. Nah, it doesn't. I don't think there's any compressing thing. It's not the conduits. It's the drawers. Says Sags. Yeah, that would make sense. So right, everyone's crafter free from RF tools. Let's give it a try. Siphon some wood. Let's get uh, a load of crafting benches made up. I mean, I know that's more than we need, but we'll just make a lot. <laughs> right, in you get. And I'll tell you what, this thing is getting laggy, so we need to hurry up and get the crafter tier three made. Now we can actually we can actually put a load of we can put seven into one, can't we? So it might just be that we don't need more than two of these. I've got a feeling. But I've got a brain smarts idea, me. I do. Actually, yeah, let's let's go back. Let's make four of these. And split the load between them, right? So craft a tier two. One, two, three, four. Tier three. One, two, three, four. Uh, except I would like to keep those. Thank you very much. Right. Hi. There we go. <laughs> Lots of people are saying compress all. Ah. Auto compressor. Is that the one? Well, that's kind of cheap. Let's have a look at that one as well. Need a block of iron. Cool. Th th that thing really did just start causing some lag, didn't it? So we got one quadruple compressed after all of that. Okay, and then the lag stops immediately, so it's clearly a problem. Okay, what's this auto compressor going to do then? Ooh, oh, it needs power, does it? Well, there happens to be some power right nearby. Um, except we'll probably end up using a flux point. Bam! We got a noise in my ear. Hello here. I'll get to you in a second because we need one more of those to receive energy, and we'll put it on the miscellaneous channel. Network, connection, statistics, hi, uh, miscellaneous, there we go. Sweet! So that is fast, but is it fast enough? Let's try Let's try one of the other ones as well. So craft a tier 3. Uh, we got a donation here, noise in the air, from I Love Cat saying, Hey X, how are you this lovely day? Hi, I'm doing good, thank you for asking. How are you? Appreciate the donation. Appreciate it. Uh, how do you get cheer? Says Joe Plain Jaw Jordan. I don't know. <laughs> is the answer. I don't know how to use Twitch. I don't really use Twitch for much else than streaming. So that's that's coming in relatively slow. Recipe is all of that, right? Now we could output to the same place. Stay in input buffer. 
All items, yes, apply. Now it should be doing that, should it not? No RF power. Let's get it a conduit. Ugh, ugh. Let's just slap a conduit down over here for a second. Right, there, well that is faster than that one. Would you agree? I think you would all agree that this is supremely faster. This looks, so that's that's not probably getting the maximum bandwidth it can, but then what we can do is do the next one in here as well. So again, we'll do that and we'll put everything into uh, internal, apply. And there we go, now we've made the next one. So we'll go here, do that, click apply. Except I did that one wrong, so we'll change it. We need to go apply like that. So it'll do it internal. Cool. Just slap these things in here. That's pretty cool. I mean, that on its own seems to be doing a pretty good job. I'm thinking when we speed this up, though, it's going to use up more of that inventory space, possibly. So let's go get a speed upgrade. We're going to need way more than those. So what is the recipe? For a good time. Hi. X, can you spell iCup? Yes, I-C-U-P. What? Oh, I've been tricked into saying something filthy. Please don't quote that out of context. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Mario says, click the snail to change the speed. Oh, can we make it faster though? That's That would be cool, because we need to go faster. Hi, there you are. Of course it's not two by two, we know that. Just how many of those can I make? So we need the electrical steel, which is boopity boop. Hi. What's the electrical steel? I'm not. Ah. <laughs> Wait, if I click there, then there it will tell me. It is that one again. Right, it's always that one, man, I tell you. So we need some iron, coal, and silicon. Are we automatically producing silicon? I think we were at one point. Almost seems like it would be a good idea just to uh, create like an automated setup for some of this stuff that's high. Furnace only, we're going to change it to all smelting. Yeah, like create a little farm somewhere that just continuously makes those for us. Right, so I'm going to put the speed on this side. Oh, what did I just do? Oh, what did I just do? Oh, I did it again. Uh, <laughs> I'll just put that there and move this thing, okay? That'll work. Okay, you need to be on miscellaneous. Cool. Right, uh, what I would like to do is, right, so insert, we can't put speed on insert actually, we have to put it on extract. So if we put 13 on there, that's theoretically getting stuff faster, we can see that already. Right, and then stay up. speed mode slow, fast. <laughs> I will put it on fast then, jeez, I mean, it felt pretty fast already. So is this triple compressed and that's quadruple compressed? Quad quadruple? Is that a word? Is that a thing? What is I cup? Says <laughs> Yevelin. Oh, if you didn't get it, don't worry. Don't don't worry don't worry yourselves about it. Let's uh, let's go make the next one. Hi, we'll put you there and uh, apply that. Sweet, so we're up to quadruple compressed. Right, now we just need to get the things in here faster. It looks so easy in the beginning, but you need such a ridiculous amount of cobble, is the problem. Okay, let's, actually, that stuff's going to help in, you know. Is it me, or is... It's just another one doing the job. Like, what we probably end up going to need is a whole bunch of these. Anyway. Wow, that was insanely fast. And now we're up to... Two! Quadruple compre compressed. Wow. I mean, we're going to be here all day. Fast nodes use more power, says uh, Hidden. Do they now? Because this didn't have power. I don't think I don't think that uses power. Just increases speed by four. Hmm. I'm not sure. Fizzbolt says, "Don't worry, there isn't a clip of that anywhere." Shifty eyes. Oh dear. Oh dear. Uh, we can make more, I guess, for now. Right, a few more. Put them in a few more places. Speed it up a little bit. It's gonna not not gonna make a ma massive difference. 
There it goes. Fast mode on the crafter, I meant to say. It's on there now. Crazy Cranberry says, why did the Scarecrow get the job? Because he was, is outstanding in the field. Oh, Lord Bozo would be proud, wouldn't he? He'd be proud of all these puns. Up to 66 levels there. Hey, I turned off that farm a while ago. It might have been a bad idea. We need our XP and stuff and things, you know. Cows, trying to survive, trying to, trying to get off the island, aren't they? Bam, we'll take that. Destroy the compressor, says Guardian. I mean, it's sort of helping do the job, is it not? Or maybe it's leaching some of the cobble that comes in. It's not. It's actually not getting cobble fast enough to keep up at the moment. That's fascinating. Right, and let's... Oh, does it keep? No, it didn't keep all the items. Okay, so slowly going through those items. Are these here or are they phantom? They're phantom. Anyway, we can do the next one as well, actually. Internal, apply, quintuple, and then there's a couple more to do. X, say toy phone as fast as you can. I mean, I'm, get, I'm gonna end up saying something really bad at this rate. I don't know what toy phone will sound like, but I'm not gonna do it. <laughs> uh, let's see if we can, I think we should make a sack mill, you know. Let's make two sack mills. Uh, what, is the, what is the recipe of coal? See, we could farm coal from mystical agriculture. We could probably farm electrical steel with it, can't you? I like doing things this way. I like creating uh, something a little bit more interesting using these other blocks. That's what's that's what's annoying about having the eggs and uh, the other things is that you don't use machines to make stuff, right? Like, I think it'd be fun to find a way to make coal out of nothing and then use a bunch of machines to turn it into coal dust. But at this rate, it kind of looks like just just craft electrical steel with that, you know? Let's see, uh, electrical... Electrical steel crop, yep, yep, you can do it that way. So, that right there is all we need. If I turn that into a pattern, actually, that just saves me uh, having to fart around crafting it. Okay, so seeds. Do you have what it takes to make that? You do. It's too easy, man. It's too easy, I tell you. Where did they go? Did that work? Oh no, it's still making it. Gotcha. <laughs> I don't know who I am, says stuff and things. X slip confirmed. The secret identity has been revealed. What does that stuff do? Tier 5. Oh, they're just crafting seeds. Hi, you can go there. Electrical steel we'll put over here. Well, that stuff's going to passively bring it in. Cutie Pie Kitten says uh, The joke I learned in elementary school was spell pig backwards, gip, and then say funny. Uh, G I P funny. <laughs> what? Spell pig backwards and, and then say funny. G.I.P. funny. I don't get it. G.I.P. Oh wait, like G. G.I.P. funny. Oh, well done. <laughs> Mr. Creator says that's why you said it's hard to keep up in, up in videos. Possibly. I say a lot of things, you know. I say so many words. Too many words. Anyway, these sack mills were supposed to be for. Uh, like we just need to put them next to power somewhere. I'm just gonna. No, oh no, I don't need to do this anymore. I was gonna make electrical steel and start with the coal, but we don't need to do that. So we're not gonna use compacting drawers. We might use another crafter. We're just looking at the moment. Ha! Look, we've got some of that already. How is that stuff made into a? Uh, to a thing. Hi. We should probably just use electrical steel. Ah, it's a circle like that. Right, we'll put that in... Oh, you get free for it! Wow, that's over the top. We'll put that into the auto-crafting one. Which I believe is full. No, it's not. Well, that's now auto-crafting electrical steel. Okay, so we don't need any of these things. Or that, or this. 
those. And these things get to go in there. And we've got that for a rainy day. A rainy day, I'll tell you. And we've got our unbreakable uh, thing over here. We can put a mod on this. What mod do you think we should put on that? Oh no, we actually used it, didn't we? Never mind. Don't listen to me. I don't know what I'm talking about. Rev Dragonus says to make fortune cookies really, really funny and then every fortune with in bed. I'm not sure I get that. <laughs> Could you tell us some jokes now, X says uh, make Kai MMC. Uh, I'm terrible at telling jokes on the spot. That is the truth right there. Ah, so we've got some of those. We can do the next one now. What ones did the Beneath even need anyway? Let's uh, internal and apply. Oh, did I get that wrong? I got it wrong. We got no quintuple. Well, we'll... Uh, how do we remove it? Ah. That. There we go. Turn it off for five seconds, says Yi uh, Jirong. Can I... Aha, there you go, so you can see the rate at which it's coming in. Uh, Sun Awesome says, Hi, I'm new to your channel, but I'm liking it. I'm glad you are. If you mean my Twitch channel, though, please do know that I am a uh, YouTuber. You should go over and check out my YouTube channel. I've got a Sky Factory series on there, which, which is a lot prettier than this place, that's that's for sure. Oh. Um, peeps, it is time for me to get on with my day, though. I've just noticed how long we've been streaming for. Unfortunately, Twitch was messing about and uh, it took me a while to get streaming this morning. So I'm running behind schedule. I've got videos to record for YouTube and all of that. So I want to end this one by saying a massive thank you to all of you for uh, tuning in today. And be sure to hit the follow button if you haven't done so already. I want to say thank you to all the people who subscribed, resubscribed, donated and cheered. Appreciate you all. Uh, as is tradition, we do a raid. And because it's Saturday morning, it probably means we're raiding someone we've never seen before. So we're going to go find another person in the Minecraft community so I can send you over. You can say hello. And uh, and yeah, just stick around for that. I'm just going to go pick someone out. Let's have a look. And who who do I even choose? I don't know how I choose. Usually it's if someone's got a beard, I might, might raid them. Ah, uh, oh, that one's German. <laughs> I do not know. Maybe we won't do a raid today, actually. I really just don't know who to send you to. Yeah, look, i, I got to go. I, got, I ain't got time to look for all these channels. Um, and it looks like a lot of them. I'm not sure what they're doing or they're in a different language. So, uh, we'll, we'll pass today, peeps. I'll be back soon. Take care, everyone. Thanks for watching. I'll see you later. Bye-bye.